to all of you American girls it's sad to imagine a world without you American girls I'd like Salut la compagnie aujourd'hui on se retrouve pour l'épisode 3 sur Life is Strange euh, donc on s'était arrêté la dernière fois euh, quand on avait renversé la peinture sur, je ne sais plus son nom, Victoria je crois. Et donc euh, on va continuer tout de suite. Pourquoi, pourquoi mes touches sont-elles changées Du temps. Euh... Ok. Mais non, je me suis trompée. Ok. Là, ah, c'est mieux. Ah, voilà, Victoria. Est-ce que je lui parle On va essayer. Ah. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max Je suis gentil. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Hmm. Charmant. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself -y. No, excuse, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Hmm, cool. Je pense que j'ai bien fait. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. On découvre le dortoir pour la première fois. J'aime bien la musique de ce jeu. I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted the man. People here are merciless. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Et on découvre la chambre de Max. Oh, C'est tout mignon. My favorite cocoon. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Alors l'intention de Max est acquis de droit. Le contenu de cette clé de nature graphique bouleversante est sujet à controverse. Cette compilation a été téléchargée par un public difficile et avec le plus grand soin en nous. Félicitons ainsi que pour votre coup exceptionnel, attendant avec impatience son retour approfondi sur Cannibal Holocaust et Ultra Vix. Amicalement Warren G. Ok. Euh... Max, le professeur m'a envoyé un mail, il paraît que tu as raconté des histoires invraisemblables à propos d'un excellent élève de Blackwell. C'est vrai, le professeur m'a dit qu'il prenait ses accusations mensongères au sérieux. Il s'inquiète pour toi, pas vite. On parle demain, bisous maman. C'est sérieux Je me fais... Euh... Non, je suis pas d'accord. C'est pas, pas faux, ni rien. Faut prendre une photo. Il y a plein de photos sur son mur. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. On fouille un peu dans la chambre. Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Bon, du coup, on suppose que c'est sa meilleure amie avant d'arriver là. Mmh. Mmh. 
music. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game, and a, man, Kristen and Fernando were so Don't drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Here's my go-to source for instant photo inspiration. Philip Lorca de Corsia. Oh, oh, man. Man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Je pense qu'en fait il faut qu'on regarde notre PC. Mais j'aime bien fouiller. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HD TV. It's not exactly pretty and pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Joyeux anniversaire, Maxine. Nous n'oublierons jamais le jour de ta naissance, ton premier sourire. C'était l'amour au premier regard. Tu nous manques, mais nous sommes tellement fiers de toi et que tu poursuives tes rêves. On t'aime, maman, papa. Oh, on peut jouer, 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 jouer. <rire> Excusez-moi. Non, mais j'ai la radio allumée. C'est con. Mmh, c'est sympa. J'aime bien jouer du bien. C'est cool qu'on puisse interact interagir avec euh, autant de choses. Bon, du coup, on va utiliser. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. One makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Qu'est-ce qu'il y a lui On l'a vu Bon, bah apparemment, il fallait pas utiliser le PC. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. Non, mais j'ai fait utiliser. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Hmm, je sais pas. Je ne sais plus ce qu'il faut faire en fait. C'est ballot. Ah non. Non. Il est... Ah si, je dois aller chercher la clé USB dans ma chambre. Je suis trop bête. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Hmm, génial. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Genre, euh, les gens ils rentrent dans sa chambre en mode yolo. C'est trop chiant. Me trouver qui c'est. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Euh, c'est là que je dois aller voir. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Answer you what? Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. <laughs> Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh, Juliet Mason. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Tellement pratique. C'était Watson, c'est ça, oui. Wow. Hey, Juliet. Is everything? Oh yes, Max. 
I've locked Dan- Juliet Watson, you be nice. You I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. <laughs> Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Mais je crois que c'est mais je crois que c'est la fille qui est enfermée hein. <rire> genre un petit épice tout mignon ok ah, un, un dessin sur ah c'est peut-être là oh Victoria give me a fucking break c'est la chambre de Victoria ça ouais mais non bon je vais retourner dans ma chambre voir parce que je me souviens pas là Là, il est super sympa sa chambre. Looks like Dana left me a little post. Non, c'est bien Dana. Great. Now I have to go get okay. the flash drive from Dana's room. On y retourne. Que l'autre elle dégage, hein, parce qu'on s'en fout de ces histoires de de petits copains à la noix. C'est pas notre problème. Euh, parlez. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Regardez. I should find a way to end this silly standoff. Je parle avec Victoria. Oh, je peux courir. <rire> Primard. Euh, regardez. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Ouais. Ça se fait tellement pas. Je peux pas faire ça. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. C'est pas très gentil. No, officer, I'm not snooping. Just... Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Je me sens dans la caca. Je peux quand même pas fouiller son... Merde. Euh... Au pire, je peux remonter le temps, non I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Okay. No, no. Je vais me faire choper. J'ai la trouille de ma vie. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Sérieux, c'est aussi simple. Ouais, j'ai des, j'ai des gros doutes. Euh, email. Juliette, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. Oh, je l'imaginais pas comme ça. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. J'imaginais pas du tout comme ça. Je sais pas Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Where was it? Je vais pas fouiller dans la chambre de Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. 
Euh, ouais. C'était une réplique, je suppose. De... Ça me dérange pas. <rire> Donc maintenant, il faut que je rejoigne ça. Ok. Ok, ok. Da. J'aime bien comment sont représentés les, les objets. En, en petite... Euh... Voilà quoi. Euh, je vois où c'est le parking par contre. Hein. C'est par là, je suppose. Fuck this shit. Mais pourquoi je là Damn, I better rewind. Euh... Je me mets. Fuck this shit. Là. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Peut-être, mais t'as pété une vitre. Je vois pas comment. Ok. Mais tant mieux, parce que j'ai pas envie d'être ton ami. Je dis ça pour que tu te décales. Euh, je vois pas comment péter une vitre peut avoir des conséquences. Au passage. Bon carte. Ah bon. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. <gasps> oh non, je sais pas quoi faire parce que prendre une photo ça peut être une preuve. Je... Est-ce que je peux prendre une photo et intervenir plus tard? Je me trouve cruel. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Ouais, je sais pas ce que j'aurais dû faire. Ça me stresse un peu. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Matt. Ok, du coup, mon vœu. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That je vais apple was so fond. over the line. I could rewind and try something different. Je peux essayer d'intervenir. So don't think I'm blind. Si I see. Je pense que je pourrais quand même euh, revenir hey, en arrière. Why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us. This is official campus business. Excuse me. You shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey. Hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Génial, encore des emmerdes. Oh putain, j'aurais peut-être mieux fait de prendre juste une photo et et ne faire rire. Oh Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Je sais jamais quoi faire dans cette cette situation. Je trouve ça affreux. Ouais. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should rewind and write oh, my own business? Oh mon dieu, je sais pas quoi faire. Euh... Oh et puis, non, mais ouais, mais je vais pas mettre... Je vais pas... Euh, prends une photo. Je <rire> suis la fille de la moindre. Moins de 6 au monde, c'est pas possible. J'aime pas ça du tout, mais alors pas du tout. Ouais, une photo. Je veux pas prendre une photo et interv intervenir. Franchement, ça aurait été mieux. Bon, mais là, j'ai une preuve qu'il a harcelé. Parce que j'ai pas pris une photo pour rien, quand même. Voyons. Voyons, voyons. I should have done something. That guy was an asshole. No! Arrête! Right. Mm. I don't get it. 
How could Zack and Victoria do that to me? Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexed Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. Aucune patience, ce mec. Il est où C'est lui Ouais. Yo, Max, check it out. What up, Max How are you Here's your flash. Thanks. <laughs> oh, ce vent. No problem. <laughs> check out my new wheels. <laughs> cool. Very old school. Uh, ouais. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there. From oh, yeah, that's what I've never seen. Which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Uh. Prefer to be honest. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch! That sounds awful the way you say it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I need to talk to somebody. Just to get it out of my system. Doctor Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me <laughs> everything. For reals, Warren. This is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me, Max. Go on. I had this incredibly bizarre experience in Mr. Jefferson's Nick. class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal. Now. Answer me, bitch! Oh, what are you can. talking about? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new. I've lived here for years. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Then you don't have to worry about me. Worry about yourself. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, <laughs> okay. Max Caulfield. I could call the police. Do it. The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude. Mec, mec, je vais te bousiller ta gueule. Nobody tells me what to do. Not my parents. Not the principal. That. Or that whore right in the bathroom. <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Go! Go! I got this! Mais vous êtes sérieux? Get in, Max! Mais vous êtes pas sérieux? Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Let's try this one. Oh putain, il a pris cher, le mec. Ok, ok, j'ai rien, j'ai rien, j'ai rien suivi. Oh non! Nathan Prescott is messed up. 
Mais euh, attends, c'est Chloé, c'était pas la meuf de la photo Oh, and thanks, Chloé. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Michelle. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloé. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Um. Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. <laughs> I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely, out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Oh, it's Um. Hmm. <gasps> I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliché geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step well, has a boat to make. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Okay. Okay, okay. In. Don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home shit home. Bon, est-ce qu'il y a encore une cinématique ou pas Euh. Um, um, oui. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Okay. Alors bon. Euh... Voilà. Bon, on va s'arrêter ici pour ce petit let's play, les amis. Et on se dit à très vite euh, pour continuer à découvrir l'histoire de cette petite personne. Ok, j'avoue, j'ai oublié son nom. Mais c'est pas très grave. Bon, on se retrouve très bientôt pour découvrir la suite. Bye